for y'all who subscribe to me, y'all probably noticed that I have a, a, put up a video in like a week or so. That's because I've been a little down lately. I got like a copyright strike on my channel for just following the fair use law. You know, just like a lot of other YouTubers out there. About two weeks ago, I got an email from YouTube saying that some company named Mobit blocked one of my videos worldwide. OGX is first impression of Macros Delta. And I sent a counter claim against it because I usually do that for all my videos that usually follow the fair use law. For y'all don't know, fair use is part of the copyright law stating that I can use some parts of a copyrighted material as long as it for review, educational, or parody purposes. And as long as you don't use so much of the material that it affects the sales of the copyrighted material. And all the videos that I do a claim to usually follow that. And then two days later, the video was taken down by Moby and I got copyright strikes on it. And I seen the reason why. Not because my video didn't follow the fairly at all or anything. It was because my channel had other other um video my channel had other videos with copyright right claims on them. Which I do is mostly AMVs, which doesn't fall for the fair use laws and I usually don't monetize them or make money off it. I keep it there because I want people to see my AMVs that I made so long ago. And I got a copyright strike for that. I just felt so bummed out about that. I just I, I just didn't want to make videos and then I thought about it and if I stopped making videos that wouldn't be fair to my subscribers and the 40 or 50 people who watch my newer videos to just stop. It wouldn't be fair to myself either because I love making these videos and I love approving on these videos and I love putting my opinions out there. So I am continue making these videos and I did a little research on Mobi. And Moby, they doing a terrible job because they take down my videos and other videos that follow the Free Lease Law. I understand that Japan, Japan got a different copyright laws than America or whatever. But they should do their research. And most of the people who put out these videos usually follow the copyright laws of America. Or at least the copyright laws of their country. There are channels out there that have four episodes. Or... A good amount of the episode of Macros Delta. So they keeping they taking out videos that use the fair use and keep up videos that clearly don't use the fair use. Until we help change the copyright laws or help and help to change the YouTube mind about their copyright stuff. Until we do that, I I guess we all I got to do is just do it and just make these videos. And I don't care to get me another copyright strike. I'm going to still make these videos. And another message to my subscribers. You'll probably notice that some of my videos is disappearing. That's because I'm moving videos from the channel to uh, other channels. Because I want as less copyrighted claimed videos on my channel as possible. So I'm moving my AMVs to one channel. And... I moved my classic video game ads to my new retro channel, Otaku Gamer X Retro, which uh, going to have those and other retro shows done with retro video games and animes and stuff like that. And don't worry, there are a lot of videos I have planned for this channel. I'm working on them now. They come out soon. So please be patient with that. And please also check out my, my retro ch channel, Otaku Gamer X Retro. And... Till then, this is Otaku Game Max, OGX for short, and I'm out.